We are talking barley, barbecue, and beets coming to Cadillac on May 17th, Friday. And we've got Kathy Leetart uh, from Hospice of Michigan with us right now. And uh, Kathy, it's uh, very exciting. This is uh, an event that is months in the making, and it's almost time. It's, How are you? I'm great. How are you? Good, good, good. Let's talk about barley barbecue and beets. Big, big, big ambitious event for a for a town of our size. It's really cool. We are really looking forward to having it. It'll be our very first barley barbecue and beets, and it happens on Friday, May 17th from 5 to 9 at the WEX. So we hope you can all come and join us. So tell us about the event. What's it all about? I mean, I know I know it's prob- it's all right there in the title, but kind of expand on that a little bit. Okay, so it is a fundraiser for Hospice of Michigan, and the purpose of the fundraiser is to be able to provide hospice care, end-of-life care, to anyone who seeks it. Regardless of their ability to pay, whether they have insurance or not, they can receive hospice care because we raise funds to be able to provide that. And hospice care is is um, it's something that is that's very, very difficult but very necessary at the end of life. It really is. End of life is always hard, but if you are facing end of life, hospice can provide that support for you and your family. And for those who have uh, who have gone through that with a family member, so many of them say, "What what a wonderful service this is." I believe everybody says, "I wish I would have had it longer." Yeah, yeah. So, what will the money specifically end up going to? That's raised by this event. It goes into our open access program, and what that is is what I described a little bit earlier is it's a fund that we have for statewide, although these funds will be local, to provide hospice care to anyone who seeks it, whether they have the ability to pay or not. And this is one of three similar events that's going on around the state. It is. We're doing this around the state. We're doing one in Detroit, one in Grand Rapids, and this will be the first time in Cadillac. And uh, so that there's uh, there's barley and barbecue and beets. So that tells me that there's a there is a uh, uh, a spirits. There is. Uh, there are spirits. To this. There yes. And there is a uh, uh, food. Yes. And there is music. Absolutely. And it all comes together. It all comes together. So let's talk a little bit about that. Uh, the music is, of course, the beats and the entertainment, and we have 1,000 Watt Profits and the Luke Winslow King Trio performing. So that'll be great. You don't want to miss that. Luke is a Cadillac native who is traveling the world yes. as a musician. Yes, he is, and, and we uh, were lucky enough to have him say yes to our event. Yes. So we're yes. very excited about that. And 1,000 Watt Profits is a very, very talented group. I, I know Denny Richards personally, the bass player, and uh, very lots, lots of Cadillac talent that'll be there that night absolutely that's what we wanted yeah yeah and that that uh, makes it all local it sure does so uh so that's covers the beets what do you want to do the barley or the barbecue next let's talk the barley go ahead the barley are uh local whiskey distilleries some make other drinks other than whiskey but what they're bringing is a signature drink that will be mixed and provided when you have your token you give your token to the vendor and you can sample what they have okay and you've got several uh, folks we sure who do. are going to be part of that. Yes, we have a lot of them. Would okay. you like me to list them? You can. All right. How about if I do that? American Fifth Spirits, Beer Distillery, Copper Kettle, Gray Skies Distillery, Iron Fish Distillery, Journeyman Distillery, Long Road Distillery, Mammoth Distillery, Red Cedar Spirits, and Two James Spirits. So we've covered that aspect of it. Now, let's cover the last part. Let's talk about the food because it all kind of goes together, doesn't Mm, it? It sure does. So we have uh, local barbecue vendors that will be bringing something. Um, It's different for each one. It's a sampling of what they have to offer, but it is definitely a barbecue theme. So you'll get to sample those. Uh, There are other tokens, extra tokens available if somebody wants to purchase more. But with your ticket, with your admission ticket, you get three samples of the barley and then three samples of barbecue to go with that. Okay. Where do folks go to get? Well, first of all, before we even talk about tickets, uh, who is represented amongst the uh, barbecuers? Okay, the barbecuers. Might as well list them too. All right, are we ready? Yes. The Black Bull Barbecue and Grill, the Grilling Company, La Senorita, Primo's Barbecue, The Q Smokehouse, and Reedy's. All right. So, uh, and and I noted a few local names in there as well. So, you bet. Yep, yep. Uh, okay, so now tickets. How do folks get tickets? How does that all work? 
Okay, you can go to our website and get a ticket in advance at $40, and they're available at www.hom.org slash BBB2019. What, what we'll do is we'll, uh, we'll put a link to it on our, on our Facebook page Excellent. so that people who are driving right now are, are attempting to write that information down. Don't <laughs> right. do that. Right. Don't Hands do that. on the wheel, firmly on the wheel. We'll, uh, we'll take care of that for you and get a, get a link on the Facebook page. So it's very exciting. This is, a, this is a huge event for the cat. It's a huge event for any size city, let alone uh, Cadillac. Sure. So we, we definitely want to see this, uh, this flourish. And is, are there thoughts of maybe this becoming an annual fundraising event for hospice? Or uh, we, we really do want it to become an annual event. So please come out and support the event. The, the, the bigger it is the first time out, the better a chance that there'll be another one. Absolutely. So if you want it to come back year after year, please come on out. All right. Uh, give us the time and the location and the date one more time, Kathy. Okay, it is Friday, May 17th at the WEX from 5 to 9 p.m. All right. Kathy Leetart from uh, Hospice of Michigan, thank you very much for your time. Thank you for having me, and thank you for supporting us. We look forward to, uh, to the big day on May 17th, Barley, Barbecue, and Beets in Cadillac.